In a nutshell, MX records are a type of entry in the DNS ledger. MX entries tell email clients where to route emails to. Setting up new MX records is simple. For starters, let's show you how the process works through your domain registrar. If you're using Bluehost, you can add new MX records for any domain you own by logging into your account and heading to the Domains tab. Now for your selected domain, go to the little drop down next to the Manage button and select DNS. There's a lot of information on this page, but we're just gonna scroll down to the MX section. As you can see, by default, we already have an MX record. It already has a priority of zero, and it has the lowest TTL, which is the value that tells your name servers how often to update your DNS records. Some hosts will allow you to have an automatic setting, while as others will let you choose between four hours and seven days. In order to add a new MX record, you're simply going to click add record. Here's where you can set the priority, host record, where it points to, and of course your TTL. When it comes to configuring the points to section, this will be provided to you. For example, from Google, it may look like this. You can set the priority level to what your mail server recommends using. This varies depending on the email service. For example, Google recommends that you set a priority level of one for its email server, with the minimum being 10 and the maximum being zero. That's really all there is to setting up a new record. Now you'll just click save and you're all set and ready to go. Keep in mind that you can set up multiple MX records for one domain. Google actually recommends that you add records for its secondary mail servers just in case. If you're using a web host that gives you access to a control panel such as cPanel, adding new MX records works a little bit differently. Within your cPanel dashboard, you'll need to look for the domain section, and then there you'll find zone editor. Go ahead and select that. On this page, select the domain you wanna add a new record to and find the plus MX record option. Now go ahead and set the priority value that your email host recommends, as well as its corresponding server URL. Now just click add an MX record and you're set. Just as I said before, you can set up multiple MX records for a single domain, but remember to use priority levels to make sure that the incoming emails know which server to try first. And there you go. If you enjoyed this video, then be sure to give it a like and subscribe for more content. With that said, thanks for watching, and we'll catch you in the next one.